Hi guys, Tim here, doing another beer review today. Today's beer is uh, something I've been I've been wanting to try it for a while. Um, never got around to getting to try it. Um, it it's only it's seasonal. It's only out once a year. Um, but I actually heard about this beer um, quite a few years ago. I just for some reason haven't had a chance to get it so I made sure this year I picked some up it's um it's from Blue Moon Brewing Company it's um Harvest Moon it's their uh it's their fall type beer it's a uh, um it's a pumpkin ale um I've I've all I've always wanted to try a pumpkin ale this is actually the first one that I heard about. I know there's other ones on the market too that I want to try um, which I have one in mind that that I know I can get my hands on if if it's not sold out yet um, but I'll, I'll do that in another review if I can get my hands on one but this this is Harvest Moon and uh that's that's what it looks like um you, if you see it on the shelf it'll give you a full view of the bottle so that's that's what it looks like and then i'll bring it up close that's what it looks like up close and uh, I'll, I'll read a little bit from the bottle for you. It says this full flavored amber ale is crafted with all the flavors of fall including vine ripened pumpkin, cloves, allspice, and nutmeg for a lightly spiced finish. It's 5.7 percent alcohol by volume and that's pretty much all the the information they give you. There's a little bit on the back, but it's pretty much what they say on the on the front. So let's get into this. Use my uh, UFO glass. Slight orangish tint to it, kind of pumpkiny, which is pretty cool. Can definitely smell a little bit of pumpkin in there. Don't really get much of the spices in the aroma. Very, very uh, light hop smell. Not much hops. Alright, let's give it a taste. Yep, I'm picking up the pumpkin definitely. Not too much of a pumpkin taste, but it's it's there. You can tell it's there. Yeah, getting a little bit of the the spices in the taste too. You can taste a little bit of a uh, like a like a pumpkin pie spice to it. It's 
not sweet at all. Overall, though, it's not bad. It's uh, it's pretty balanced beer. Um, and you do get a little bit of the pumpkin in there, which is which is what I was hoping. I was hoping you could at least taste the pumpkin a little bit, which you can. It's it's not bad. Um, if you wanna. Um, try out some of the pumpkin ales for the fall um, this would be a good place to good beer to start with it's, it's not bad it's pretty good um, I definitely would uh, drink this every once in a while it's not something that I would go out and buy all the time but um, if I'm if I'm in the mood for it I'll, I'll definitely go and pick a pick a few up. It's pretty good. It's not bad. So yeah. Give it a try. Good start for a pumpkin ale. But um, like I said, I have another one in mind that um, from what I hear pretty much tastes like a pumpkin pie in a bottle. I'm not going to say what it is right now, but because I don't know if I'll still be able to get it, but I should be able to. So hopefully I'll be able to get that and do a review on it. So I will see you guys soon and have a good day.